Welcome back. Our St. Louis Blues are on fire. Well, <laughs> somebody squelched the fire a little bit. <laughs> we're not but we're talking we're, about that. It's just a little bump in the road. Yep. They are back at Enterprise Center tonight for playoff game. And what will a win tonight mean for our St. Louis team? We go live to Laura Hedegar. <laughs> She's out there at the Enterprise Center. Now what, Laura? Yeah. Well, guys, it is a huge, huge game tonight. As you know, the Blues are up 2-1 to one on this series, and they want to get a win on home ice tonight. I really don't know too much about hockey. I'm learning, but the next gal who's with me, she knows all about it. This is Ashley Weiss with the St. Louis Blues. So, Ashley, how important is it to get a win at home in Game 4? Tonight's game is going to be really big for both teams, actually. Um, like you said, the Blues lead the series 2-1. to one. The Jets would love to go back to Winnipeg with a tied series. The Blues do not want to go back in that situation. They would love uh, to go create more separation and go up 3-1 to one and possibly even end it in Winnipeg on Thursday. It's always fun to end it on the road. Um, so I'm expecting a really physical game between both teams, a lot on the line from both teams, and expecting a really big response from the Blues after Game 3 because this is a team that has handled adversity very well and bounced back very well all season long and it's been a while since the blues have lost two in a row right it's been several weeks it has so that has not actually happened since mid-march on top of that jordan bennington uh, the blues goaltender has never lost two consecutive starts in his nhl career which started back in january so expecting a lot from him tonight as well that is a huge trend we like that so of course jordan bennington one to watch who else should we be paying attention to tonight Someone I would watch tonight is Vladimir Tarasenko. He had his first goal of the postseason on Sunday night, and once he gets going, the team, you know, the team really feeds off of that, not to mention this team has shown that they have a lot of scoring depth. You have the second and third line scoring very consistently right now. So if you get Vladimir Tarasenko and that top line scoring on top of that, that's going to be a very good recipe for the Blues. And that's why we brought her, because she knows what she's talking about. I love everything about it. And then, Ashley, I'm putting you on the spot. My last question, what song do you think is going to be played in the locker room tonight. Gloria, undoubtedly Gloria, get your stereos ready. Um, that's definitely what the Blues were hoping for tonight and they hope to bring it to the Blues fans after the game as well. Ashley Weiss with the St. Louis Blues. She has a long day, but she's rocking the blue. It's going to be awesome here at the Enterprise Center. And even if you can't make it tonight, there is a lot of fun happening around St. Louis. We are going to get into more of that coming up a little later oh, cool. right here on Great Day St. Louis. It's a good Guys, idea. listen to back Interesting to contrast there between the hockey knowledge between yeah. our guests and our. <laughs> Laura is more of a broadcaster, <laughs> but she picked the right interview subject. That's right. You nailed it. Yeah. Way to Thank go. you, Laura, very much. <laughs>